Understanding relations is a very important part in SolidWorks. Relations are used to make entities in a sketch, like lines, circles, and points, relative to one another. For example, if you would like to make two lines become parallel, you can add a relation to them to make them always be parallel. You can also add a relation to a single entity, like making a line horizontal or vertical. When you start adding entities to a sketch, it is important for you to know that SolidWorks will add relations automatically. For example, when you draw a line from left to right, it'll add a horizontal relation. This relation can be removed if you do not want it. There are two different ways to add relations. The most common is by holding shift or control and selecting the entity or entities you are adding the relation to, and then selecting the type of relation using the menu on the left or the pop-up menu that will appear next to your mouse. The other way is to use the add relations feature in the sketch tab and selecting the entity or entities you are adding the relation to. Here are some of the most common relations you will be using. Horizontal or vertical is used to make lines or two points horizontal or vertical to each other. These are shown as two different relations. Collinear is used to make two different lines follow the same path as one another. Co-radial makes two arcs or circles have the same center point and same radius. Perpendicular makes two lines perpendicular to each other. Parallel will make two lines parallel to each other. Tangent will make an arc and a line tangent to each other. Concentric will make two or more arcs have the same center, but not the same radius. Equal will make the lengths of two or more lines or radius of two or more arcs be equal to each other. Merge points will make two points merge together. Relations are a very important thing to understand and can help you while you create a sketch.